Right. We are here with uh, not only is he in a cool t-shirt, but he's for a cool cause. We're here with Doug here at the Second Amendment Rally in Barberton. And uh, you noticed the shirt. I love the shirt. How long do you think? Oh, uh, you know, right now they're so focused on the whole uh, porn star thing. And, uh, you know, it's, they're, uh, they're dragging their feet off. This should, this should be priority one. Figuring out what, what Hillary did, what Obama did, what emails went, what happened in Benghazi. But, you know, right now all they care about is the porn star that had, what, 10 years ago? So I'm hoping it's real soon that they feel like they figure out the whole thing. Do you think it's going to go in the direction where, uh, unfortunately, Clinton did, where he was able to literally sell nuclear trade secrets to China and get away with it? Do you think she's going to be able to pull off this email? Oh, she's yeah. pulled off. She's pulled off so much already that it wouldn't surprise me one bit. Um, I think that she thinks she's completely, totally untouchable. And I think in her mind that she's uh, she's already got away with it. Do you think Sessions is going to finally grow some teeth on this, or do you think he's hiding from the Clinton machine as well? Oh, he's hiding from the, the Clinton machine as well. He doesn't want to end up with, uh, you know, two bullets in the back of his head and suicide. Suicide, yes. You know, um, it, it's, it's sickening that how many people that have uh, gone after the Clinton have ended up missing or dead. You know, it's, uh, it's not a coincidence one for that at all. So what is it that makes you think we're about to finally reach the point where this ends? I think Trump is finally going to put his foot down and say, you know what, get to it or get out. You know, um, everybody can, was always talking about this revolving door of Trump's, and um, it has nothing to do with him being incompetent. He just doesn't put up with anything. He's a businessman. If you're not doing your job in a business, you get out, you're fired. But he's finally going to find somebody, eventually, who's going to step up and do the job. And I'm hoping it's just a matter of time before we can see that. Amen. All right, in closing, what brings you out today? Uh, obviously supporting the Second Amendment, but uh, what? Uh, uh, Barberton is my hometown. You know, born and raised in Barberton, spent most of my life here, and uh, it's just uh, really awesome to see this happening in my hometown. You got to play with your. Uh, I'm a huge supporter of the Second Amendment. I think we all should have the right to bear arms, protect ourselves, and uh, you know, the criminals aren't going to follow the law, so we've got to show them that we can. Very true. Mommy's I was just saying earlier, if, 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 a, if a lady protects herself from an attack with a gun, you don't hear about it. But if somebody with a gun rapes a lady, you'll hear about that. Yeah, it's front page news. Just like uh, anytime there's a, a shooting by a criminal, you automatically hear the make and model of the gun. But if somebody uses a gun to protect themselves, it's not even a blip on the news anymore. Never. Never. You know, um, just like the, shoot, the school shooting a couple of uh, months ago with a the uh, guy stopped it, the uh, resource officer. It barely made the news, you know. But uh, the guy down in Florida, we're still hearing about it almost every day. Mm -hmm. Hogs become a hero. Hogs Somehow. become a hero, and uh, he's, he's a completely different story. I don't want to go off on that tangent, but you know, <laughs> uh, it's just sad that we're putting the criminals and their actions up on a pedestal and putting in the closet the things that are happening with the good guys. So. Thank you so much. If you get a chance, look up the Conservative Daily Post with Teddy Stick. I rate for them. And the show is the correct view. Correct view. All right. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Thank you.